Hi there, I'm Kainoa Harbottle, and welcome back to Kainoa on Coins. This is our continuing series in which I share with you some of my favorite material. Uh, stuff that I don't necessarily want to give up, but it's stuff that people always ask me about that they want to see on video. And so I want to give it to you. Hopefully you'll be able to take at least some ideas of mine and incorporate into work you already do. Or you'll find a brand new routine. It's something that you'll find extremely useful. I brought four coins for you. The reason I brought these four coins is I've trained each of them to do a different trick. Awesome. Okay. The next piece in our series is called Quattro. Quattro is one of my favorite coin tricks. I perform it all the time. It's a real worker. You get to see four coins, they get to do all these different tricks, and you'll get to learn a lot of different slights that you can apply however you want in your magic. Two and three, they have a strange attraction. They're almost magnetic. <clears throat> so that means if I hold one coin in this hand over here, the other coin over here, all it takes is a moment. The one coin will jump over to be with its friend, just like that. Uh, that's what two and three do. <laughs> Uh, number four is a strange coin. It's a time traveling coin. See, <laughs> you don't believe me. It's a, you know what I do? If I blow, the coin goes back in time to where it was a moment before. On the table? <laughs> See? Although sometimes when I put that coin, I put it on the table and give it a little rub, it reappears back at my fingertips. See? Um, now, some people don't believe this. A time traveling coin it just goes back in time? No, really. It just goes back in time. It really just goes back in time to where it was a moment before. Well, people say that if you could see the coin go back in time, they'd actually see it go back in time. <laughs> Kainoa on coins, taking your coin magic to the next level.